Hey everyone, how's it going? In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to draw a Valentine's Heart Surprise Fold. So hope you follow along and enjoy this video today. Now to start off with our Valentine's Day Surprise Fold, let's begin by folding our paper in half. So I'm going to go ahead and line up both corners. And once I have them lined up, I'm just going to give them a nice fold right down here. Kind of like I'm making a Valentine's card. Next, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to fold them one more time. Line up the corners, give it a nice fold. This way it kind of looks like a big bookmark. Now, when I open it up, I have these nice little guidelines in here that show me where I need to keep the inside of my drawing at. Now, to start off with this, we're going to be making a heart. So we're going to want to make the top part of the heart here. We're going to make two really big bumps. So I'm going to start right about here, and I'm going to make a line that's just going to curve up and down. Then I'll do the same thing here. I'm just going to curve up and then down. Now underneath here, I'm going to bring this line down at an angle. And then we're going to bring it up and just kind of connect it right to there. Now we want to make a little face on this heart. So we're going to make some eyes. So I'm going to begin by drawing a circle for an eye. Leave some space and I'll make another circle for an eye right here. I'm going to draw a circle inside of here and another circle right inside of here. I'm going to make a small circle here and a small circle here. And I'm going to color in the inside. Then right down here, I'm just going to make a little smile like this. Now around here, I'm going to add just a couple little extra hearts on here just to give it a little bit more detail. So I'm just going to make a couple little hearts on here. So we're just going to put a couple right around here. I like to do like an odd number out here. So I'll put two down here. That way we have five hearts total. Now our next step is we want to open this up and add all the details on the inside. Now, once we have it open, we have this big empty space that we want to fill in here. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to bring this line down a little bit past the fold. And same thing here, bring this one down a little bit past the fold. I'll also do that same thing here. I'm going to bring this up here, and I'll make this up here. Next, I'm going to go ahead and just connect this line here. And then this one, though, what I'm going to do is I'm going to draw a line that's going to come down, and I'm going to bring this line over to here, and I'm going to bring it up just a little bit. Next, I'll do, this, do the same thing here. I'm just going to bring this line over to here, and then I'm going to connect them. And then I'll put a little curve line right here. Now I'm going to add some teeth on here. So I'm just going to make some big curved teeth right here. And then same thing here. I'm just going to make some big curved teeth on here. Next, I'm going to make a tongue. So I'm going to draw a line that's going to curve around. And it's going to come back here with another little curved line right here. Now starting here, let's make a line that's going to come down, and then another line that comes down here, and then I'll make a second line right here. That way it kind of gives it a little bit of like a 3D effect. Now, right over here, I'm going to add some little wings on here. So I'm going to put one here and one here. So to draw the wings, I'm just going to make a line that's going to come up with a curve, it's going to come down, 
And I'll do another one up with a curve and down, a little curve and down, and then one here. And I'll do the same thing here. I'm going to come up to a curve and then down, a little curve and down, curve and down, and then one more here. Now, inside of here, you could put like whatever, but I think it's gonna be kind of fun if we put a little saying in here. So I think let's just put I love you in here. So let's make a letter I. So we're gonna make a nice little block shape letter I right in here. Then we're gonna write the word love. We're gonna do that in big block letters. And I want these to be bigger than the I. And it's okay if they're touching too. So I'm gonna put some of these big letters right here. I kind of like when they're next to each other. So we're going to put some of these big letters in here. And then we'll make the little E over here at the end. And then I'm just going to keep it simple. I'm just going to write the letter U instead of writing the whole word U out. So we're just going to make the letter U. Then let's just fill it up with some more little hearts in here just to make it even more fun. So we're just going to put a bunch of little hearts all around here. And I'll put a couple down here too. We'll even put some in here. And there you go. There is your drawing of kind of like a funny little heart surprise fold. So when I have it all folded up, I've got the nice little heart right here. Then when I open it up, the mouth is wide open, it's got some wings, and shouting, I love you. And there you go. I'm going to fast forward and start coloring this. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed.